Hello guys. Daddy wasn't planning on reading for a couple days, but someone is tugging on my heart. I'm feeling somebody's heartbreak. I'm feeling someone. I'm feeling someone. As the powers of evil are me during this reading, you all know how I see and read. Please help me interpret these cards as you see fit. Who is tugging on my heart? Who is tugging on my heart? And what message would you like to get out for them today, Spirit? Who is tugging on my heart? Who is tugging on my heart? Mm. Hey, guys. Empaths, light workers out there. You got to know what energy is yours and what energy is not. I know this is not my energy. Daddy's feeling really good today. Daddy's had a good day. But I know someone connected to someone who's going through it. And there's a lot of heartbreak. That's for damn sure. That's for damn sure. You want to call upon Archangel Michael to protect me. Collective as I open to channel this message. What do you have? Who is tugging on Daddy's heart? Who is tugging on my heart? Who needs kind words today? Who's going through it? Please and thank you, Spirit. Please and thank you, Spirit. I've been feeling for about the past hour, hour and a half, guys. Oh, dear Heavenly Father, whoever I have connected into, whoever is connecting into me, please send them the love, peace, and guidance that they need at this moment. Someone's obviously going through it. They don't need this energy. <sighs> send your angels to guide Help soothe, help heal, help someone mend their heart, help someone make smart choices to recover and heal and find a happier place to live, happier, happier, happier place to live. Um, Please and thank you, Spirit. Whoever I connected to, you're going to be okay, okay? Get out of that energy. Don't stay stuck. Page of Swords and the Three of Cups. Okay, you know what? If you're going through a situation, guys, uh, third-party situation, okay? It's tough. But if they didn't make you as a choice, they didn't make you as a choice, okay? You you can't you can't wallow in that. That was their decision. How you respond now is what you're about, okay? So quit snooping. Get off the social media. If you can't talk to this person, you don't need to be watching this person, okay? This ain't getting you nowhere. This ain't getting you nowhere. Either talk, get it out in the open, have the discussion, or move the fuck on, okay? It's a little tough love here. I'm feeling it. You're putting yourself through it, and there's no fucking reason to. Seven of Pentacles in reverse, Five of Cups in reverse, and the Sun in reverse. Yeah, you know what? Past regrets. You can't wallow in that. You cannot wallow in that energy, okay? There is no happiness there. You can't go back and change the past. You can't go back and fix the past. The past is in the past. You've got to overcome it. It's up to you to turn this sunshine upside down, right? It's you to bring, it, it, it's you who can bring the happiness into your life. And if watching a third-party situation, watching somebody that you should know you shouldn't be watching, you know, you got to detach from that. you got to detach from that. Perhaps you're just stuck because there is no movement here, okay? Someone is obviously just watching with a lot of remorse, feeling sorry for themselves. Mm -hmm. You got to get out of that energy, okay? You can't stay in that energy. The emperor, 
in reverse the six of swords yeah you're not wanting to move away from this energy you can't stay stuck in these emotions you got to move on to find calmer waters you got to move on to find peace okay if the person isn't in your life they're not in your life for a reason so you you got to just deal with that accept it and, and move on though i know it's easier said than done you got to do what you got to do, but you can't stay trapped in, in, in energy that's going to keep you sad and energy that's going to keep you bogged down. I know you're going through it. I feel it. Okay, I feel it. I feel it. My heart, my heart's feeling it right now. Okay. <sighs> yeah. You know, guys. You can't watch tarot just to snoop on the other person. Uh, they're, they're doing their thing, okay? If they didn't choose you, they didn't choose you. So you got to just accept that fact and move the fuck on, okay? If you're in the fault in this, well, then you screwed up. You don't get a chance to go back in. You got to deal with you, okay? You, you can't wallow in this pain. You can't stay with a broken heart. You cannot do that. That is not healthy. That leads to erratic behaviors. That leads to stupid behaviors. That leads to you not being in your power. Five of Swords. The Empress in reverse. The judgment in reverse. Bonus Love. The Hermit in reverse. See? Okay. Okay, past energy, five of swords, someone very dominant. So, okay, not to exacerbate any situation, but whoever's feeling this is probably the one that fucked up. Maybe being a little too dominant, maybe being a little too controlling, maybe being a little too harsh. This five of swords is dominating two other people. Okay, we've seen that with the three of cups. Okay, a situation went south. So either you screwed up to the point that someone left you, or you know, you know. We don't even have to go into this, okay? You're carrying burdens. Eight of Cups and the Knight of Pentacles. You're carrying burdens because you knew you wanted to go in and uh, move away from a situation to make an offer. You knew you wanted to do that, but I, I don't see that you're doing it. You were carrying burdens. So right now, this tells me that you're you're just stuck in your past regret, okay? You got to get out of the past. You can't change the past. What was done was done. Now, in situations like that, you can either try to correct the situation, fix the situation, or if you fucked up to the point you can't go back, you're just going to have to realize you fucked up and it's over, okay? You can't go back and keep dwelling on what you should have done. Because you didn't, right? So don't live in that energy. You can't live in that energy. The Empress in reverse, the King of Swords, the Three of Swords, and the Ace of Wands in reverse. Yeah, okay. Uh, Y'all, I know you're heartbroken right now, but Daddy's going to give it to you straightforward. Someone's dominant energy. With the Five of Swords here and the King of Swords showing up, someone knows they mistreated somebody. Someone knows they fucking mistreated this Empress. And they know this Empress is done with them if you got to the point that the empress is in reverse you know you done fucked up okay so you're stuck in this heartbreak yeah i know you're feeling it and you know what that's probably your karma because uh you hurt somebody you hurt somebody and now you're feeling what the hell you put somebody else through but I'm telling you, you can't live in that energy. Okay, the past is the past. You've got to get over it and move forward from it. You you cannot stay. You cannot stay in this energy. Yeah, someone knows they can't get a they can't get a new start. Someone knows that the situation is just done because someone's dominance. Now this could be a male. This could be a female, guys. 
It's just showing up someone who was very dominant in this situation. Someone who was very dominant and who had the... Who, who was the one that, that, that hurt somebody else to gain out for their own good and now they're feeling the fucking pain from it, okay? Again, Mercury retrograde energy. Yeah, judgment in reverse. This is future energy. Judgment in reverse. Eight of Swords in reverse. Page of Pentacles in the upright. And the Ace of Cups in reverse. Okay. Someone is definitely getting their karma. They're wanting someone back from the past, but they know that ain't going to happen. So you're going to have to definitely get out of your head. Get out of this mental prison that you're in. You can't stay stuck in this, this heartache, this pain. That, that ain't going to serve you. That isn't going to serve you right now. That's just keeping you feeling like shit. You did what you did. You you can't you can't go back and change that. You can either try to fix the situation or you just got to let it be where it is and and move the fuck on. But this ad uh, this probably isn't even your choice. This is uh someone else's choice. Cuz someone wants to go in and make an apology, but you see this ace of cups in reverse? They either know the love is gone in a situation, they done did too much that someone just cut it off. Or even when this person comes forward, they're still not going to be emotionally uh, truthful. They're not going to be emotionally vulnerable. Some another card on that. Justice in reverse. No. Okay, you guys, I mean, I hate to say it, but someone fucked up to the point that, you know, they don't deserve this love. But the Ace of Cups in reverse and the Justice in reverse? That's something that a simple-ass apology ain't gonna fix. Daddy hates to be, uh, 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 well, I don't hate to be straightforward. This is what you need to hear, Right? You know it was an unjust situation. You know at the end of the day there is some emotion there, but you know what? Someone done someone done fucked everything up. You you fucked everything up. The only way you can change things is try to equal shit out. See? Yeah. This is the point. Someone's wanting to come forward and make an offer now. After they done fucked the situation up, they know the whole situation is unbalanced. They know they can't. They can't do anything till they turn this card upside up, upside down, right, and make this a justice, a justice in the upright. You know, you're heartbroken. You're feeling it, but you know. I think you kind of set the stage for this. You set this situation up. You definitely did a lot to turn this empress off. And now you know that you can't just come in with some simple-ass apology to fix a situation. So I'm telling you, you can't stay in this energy, though. You can't live in this regret. You did what you did. When you were making those choices, you obviously had no trouble making those choices. But now that shit's coming back, you're getting judgment for it. You're getting karma, and you see where you want to go. Now you're feeling the pain that you inflicted upon others. And yeah, you're not going to be able to just go in and not put forth any work and just swoop somebody off their feet, okay? So if that's what you're living in, you, you that that's... Because that's the energy here. The Hermit in Reverse, the Page of Wands in the Upright, the Six of Pentacles in the Upright, and the Magician... You're realizing what you did. You know what you did. But now you're wanting to come in and, and get a new start and think you can balance out the shit by trying to manifest it. But you're, you're, daddy's trying to be tactful here. Um, yeah. 
was your lack of indecision. You, someone put themselves in this position. You know, you're feeling pain now that you probably easily inflicted on others, but now that you're getting it, you're not liking it. And you're wanting to do a quick band-aid fix on it. But Four swords in reverse, ten of cups in reverse, and the ten of pentacles in reverse. With the death card. We know this is a third party situation. You're watching somebody. That's what puts you in this energy. Because you know. Ah, oh, sweet Jesus. You haven't healed from this this loss, this Ten of Cups loss, the love loss, right? But we also got the Ten of Pentacles here with the Death card. So, if you're with somebody, how could you be pining over somebody else? This is obviously somebody in a marriage, someone in a relationship they know they need to end. Because the one that they love, this, this cup energy... Yeah, you're, you're not even healed from that. This is the heartbreak. This ain't the one you're with. Or you wouldn't be feeling so heartbroken. Because you're with the one that you're with. I tell you, choose to move away from that. So, you know, again, lack of indecision. What do you want? If you're in this, you don't get this too. That's why you're stuck in this. You got to make a decision or you just got to live with what you've done and, and go forward. But you can't have heartache in this. You, you, you can't. You either fix the situation or you move the fuck on from it. But you don't get you don't get to play both sides. You don't get your cake and get to eat it too. What I can tell you from my see from the cards here, we got the Knight of Pentacles here. Being blocked by not having any start. Someone knows that they took their sweet ass time moving forward to get this start. Now they know they can't get this start. Now they're feeling some kind of way emotionally. But, but I mean, look at this. This is the way I'm looking at the cards. All three of these are on horses moving in the same direction. Knight of Cups. The Death card. And the Knight of Pentacles. So you either need to move away from your situation, move away and do what you need to do. Either way, there's something you need to end. You need to end it. It is that fucking simple. You can't keep watching who's not in your life. Especially since we've seen from the cards that you took this person out of your life. That was your choice to remove this person from out of your life. Okay? That was your choice. Now what you're feeling is probably the same thing you put somebody else through. Daddy's telling you. You can't stay in this energy. You got to move away from it. Uh, whatever direction you go, you either stay where you're at and make it work. 
or you move away from that and go towards what you want to see if you can fix the situation. But, you know, that is somebody else's decision, not yours at the end of the day. There's movement here in these cards on the horses. Now, the Knight of Pentacles is a little slower, but the Knight of Cups here and the Death card. There's movement. Instead of sitting there wallowing in your broken heart, start, start doing something. But you can't stay in this energy. But I don't see a resolution. We have movement. But where are you going? Daddy's guess is in circles. You're just circling. You're circling, you're circling, you're circling, and you're not actually going. Going forward, doing anything to move forward, doing anything to actually accomplish something. You can't stay in that pain, though. Perhaps maybe that's your karma. You need to stay in that pain to feel it. But, you know, uh, you got to... Um, you got to face some truths. you got to face some truths. Do the right thing. Peace, love, and light. Sending you love and healing light and guidance. But uh, you kind of know what you need to do. You're just not doing it. Peace, love, and light. Thank you.